Hey everybody, it's Crystal and today we are going to look at how easy it is for you to set up your store with Wix or Shopify and like which one you should use, you know, which one makes more sense for your business. Obviously there are other solutions. These are just the two that I'm going to get into today. All right. I do have a Wix website and I also have a Shopify website. I'm going to be honest with you. I have been team Shopify for a very long time. I love Shopify and there are several reasons why. However, you know, Wix does provide a quick, easy solution as well, but we're just going to go through it today. We're going to talk about like which one and all of that because you've been asking me. And so let's just get started. All right. So this is the homepage for Wix. And uh, as you can see, it says try Wix, no credit card required required. So we're going to hit get started. Um, let me see, because I created a email. Right. So then we're going to set up, they want it to be longer. Now, how long do we got to be? Must have at least six characters. Uh, and this, I don't know that's long enough. Maybe I'm tripping. Okay. So we're going to sign up. All right. So we're just going to hit get started. What kind of website are you creating? Let's do a store, online clothing store. Now, this is the part that Wix kind of really kills it on. Like they give you the game and will really kind of create the store for you. So it says store already built in. They're saying you can chat, you can add Instagram, feed, pricing plans, video bookings, all of that. So I love this. Um, I'm going to leave the chat. I'm not going to add Instagram feed, but that would be really good to add. Uh, let's see if we need anything else. I don't, but you may need that depending on what your business is about. So I'm going to hit next. You can also hit skip over there, but I'm going to just hit next. Have you created a website before? So your girl has definitely created a whole lot of websites, but I'm going to put, this is my first time because I want for you to see like how easy it is. Okay. So I'm going to let their ADI system and all that good stuff do that. Or you can also choose the template. But today, like I said, let's go through how easy it is. So I'm going to hit start now. What is the name of your online store? So I'm just gonna use Girl Plus God Test. Uh, I'm gonna hit skip. If you did already have a, a website, a domain, you would add this in here and you would go to a place like GoDaddy to go get your domain, right? And if that was the case, I will put like a girlplusgodtest.com right there. But I'm gonna skip this. All right, cool. Um, you could add your info. I'm not gonna do that right now. Now here is what, here is where it gets fun. Okay, so I think out of all of these, I'm gonna go for chic. I'm, I'm gonna give chic today. Okay. Pick your favorite homepage design, baby. Look at look at this. You literally have a store. Do you hear me? Do you hear? I'm gonna go ahead with this middle one. And I'm gonna tell you why, right? The left one, it has the picture on one side, the welcome on the left, cool. But it's the center picture with the header right there, logo on, on the left side at the top, the menu to the right, products right in the middle. This one just jumps right out at me as somebody who has created a lot of websites. So I'm gonna go with number two. 
let me know which one you would go with. Um, just looking at this again, I chose chic. So if we went back and chose a different one, it would look totally different. So go with your vibe of your brand, whatever you're looking for, whatever your customers are going to be excited about. I'm feeling chic today. So I'm going to go ahead and use this design. Wix is really making me happy with this builder. This, I love this. All right. And I'm I'm telling you, I'm I don't play about my Shopify, but this it and there's a reason. We're gonna talk about that later. But for now, um love. Let's add about, let's add FAQs, let's add that, let's add this. You need a good contact form, store policies. I mean, I, I literally feel like I'm in a store and I'm so excited to just add it all. <laughs> all right, so let's go and edit site. Look at this. Look, we got a whole website. How long I've been doing this? I don't even know how long it is at this point, but look at how easy that was to put this website together, all right? Obviously, you're going to have to take some time to kind of, you know, make it clean and amazing for um, for your customers to actually see before you publish it. But I just, I love this. You don't even have to go out and grab a logo instantly. You can say, um, I just want to, I want to have a really clean, simple, and then look how that just changed, right? Love that. You can change the picture, right? You can change everything on here, but they've made it so simple for you to set your store up, right? Um, let's see, what's manage store? They give you a tour, okay. So if you are looking for an easy solution, um, to sell your products, especially if you are somebody who, let's say you're a coach and you're adding this, you're adding some products to an existing coaching business or you're a different type of entrepreneur. I think that Wix is really great for that. My Girl Plus Goals website is on Wix. And that again was not where I wanted it to live. But after I seen how easy it was for me to kind of manage it, I decided to do it on there because it's not a store. So I didn't need Shopify um, at the time. Now that could change later on, but just look how quick and easy that was for us to, um, to put this together. So let's see if we go to manage our store. Somebody screaming outside and I'm like, I know you hear me doing this video. <laughs> Like, dang. Okay, so let's go add a product. And I'm going to be honest, I'm not exactly sure which dropship companies, if any at all, will connect to Wix. So this may be a situation where um, you will have to research that and you will also, you know, have to see if you have your products in-house or anything like that, then of course, this is no problem. So they already have these templates in here for you, which is great. I'm going to go ahead and say, let's see if I can edit this one. Okay. Um, girl plus guy hoodie, black on black, right? You haven't connected a payment method. Customers will not be able to buy from your store. I got it. We know, okay? We ain't paid you yet. But that's even cool too. The fact that you can do all of this, you can build your house, your whole store literally for no money, right? We're talking about literally setting your whole website up without ever giving a dollar. That's, I mean, I'm happy. I'm happy. All right, so let's finish editing the product. Let's see if they will let me go ahead and add an image. Uh, let's see, images. Um, now they even have 
things on, they have like stock photos here as well. So even if you haven't done a photo shoot, they have some really good stock photos. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a picture that I had on my desktop. All right, I'm gonna remove these because we do not need those pictures there. Boom, look at your girl, look, look at your girl. All right, so I'm gonna mark this hoodie at $50. I'm gonna talk about the hoodie, best hoodie you will ever get, baby. Okay, we're not gonna put the baby. You obviously want to put as much information as you can about the product here. You wanna say what it's made out of, you wanna get very descriptive, but for now, for this, we're just gonna, we're gonna stick with that. Uh, I'm just gonna put, so they let me put a brand name. Let's just see if I can just put a girl plus God as a brand name here. And you can kind of add your, once you go in here and edit, you can have your return policy, shipping policy, all of that, right? So this is a lot of stuff that you'll have to um, play around with because based on the color, based on the price and the size, um, that's gonna determine all of your variants. So that just basically means that every single size is going to be a different weight. So if you can see right over here, it says shipping weight. So you're gonna need to put that in, you're gonna need to put in small, medium, large, extra large, all of that. And also input your inventory. And that just means showing how many you have Cool. And then right now it has two different colors. So when you manage your variants, you're just basically going to go in and let them know this is what I have and this is how much I need to sell, right? They even have a subscription, which I think is really great because this is already built in versus on Shopify where you have to add something to the app store, which we will, like I said, we will also go over that. But Boom, so we save this, right? So then let's see if I can go back to my store. And now look, our product is here. So very easy to set up. We have not spent a single dollar yet. Do you hear me? We have not spent a single dollar yet. You can set this up the same day and start selling your products the same day. So let's go on over to Shopify and see what it's talking about. Okay. Let me not get rid of this. I'm gonna just go to a new tab and we'll go with a good old Shopify. Mama's home Shopify. She oh. Y'all know I love me some Shopify, okay? So we are going to start our free trial. Like Wix, Shopify has a, a free 14-day trial. So you can go ahead and click start free trial. I'm gonna use my same email that I set up for this. I can get myself together. I just hope they do not make me log in to that email to confirm it. Please, Shopify, don't do me like that. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Shopify love to like date you. Okay, Shopify, let's talk. Are you already selling? So let's say we are brand new. We are not selling products yet. All right, what is your current revenue? I'm not even gonna say zero, right? We're not even gonna speak that. We're gonna say we making something. I'm just I'm gonna say a million. What industry will you be operating in? Clothing. All right, so let's sit next. Oh, now they want all my information. That's cool, that's cool. I'm just gonna go ahead and let me see what address I'm gonna use. Uh, Okay, I can just use anyone. All right. Boom. 
This is not my information, guys. So please do not, <laughs> please do not use this. Boom. This is your Shopify back end. Now, just like Wix, you know, they have their own little setup. And like I said, depending on what you need will depend on where you should be. Um, with Wix, you pretty much start with the website. And the purpose of that is because Wix is a website platform. Okay, hear me when I say Wix is a website platform. So they want to make sure that your website looks great. So you start with your website design. You start with um, what it looks like to everybody else. With Shopify, you start in the back end. So that means Shopify cares more about you selling your products because obviously that's how they make their money. Okay. So they want for you to do as well as possible. They want to provide the best solutions for you so that you will sell as much as you can so that they can make as much as they can. So consider that when you are saying, do I want to use Shopify? Do I want to use Wix? Wix is really great if you're just looking for a good like website, um, front facing with your uh, customer seeing like, hey, it's a really dope website. You know, maybe you're just trying to test out some products and you don't really know. Um, whereas Shopify is really for the game changing entrepreneur. Shopify is for the person that knows they're going to make that million dollars, right? Shopify can handle it because they are an e-commerce platform. They are here for you to sell as much as possible and they have every single resource available to help you. Okay. Um, so we did not do this with Wix. So I need to go back to check to see how much their plans are. So let's look to make sure I do that first because I know you may want to know how much each are. Okay, so for business and e-commerce, you have business basic, $23 a month. You have business unlimited, $27 a month. And they're telling you kind of all that you have and then business VIP, right? Again, this is a website platform that has included e-commerce. When I think about Shopify, I think about, like I just told you, they want you to make that money. They want, they want all the money, right? Um, so their plans start at, we're going to look at monthly, uh, $29 a month, $79 a month, $2.99 a month. Now, let me go, let me make sure that I'm on monthly. Okay. So I'm going to be honest for like the first four years, I was hanging strong on this $29 a month plan, right? It was not until I started hiring more people that I needed a little bit more. So Shopify, you can definitely do this $29 a month plan when your trial is over. But again, it's like, this is for that game changing entrepreneur, right? You can easily get to a lot of things. So again, this is your back end. They're going to explain to you how to do everything. And right over here to the left is where your orders will live, products, all of that. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go ahead and add a product. And then I'm going to show you what the actual website looks like. I'm going to show you how to utilize some of the things on Shopify and you know some of my favorite things. And then of course, you, you can definitely make the decision like which one is gonna be right for me, which one is gonna help me in my business. Nothing wrong with trying both, going back and forth, right? There's, there's nothing wrong with that at all. But at the end, I will tell you which one I think that you should definitely lock in with, but I think, <laughs> I think that's clear. So, all right, let me get one with it. Girl plus guy, black hoodie. All right. Dang, I can't type. All right. 
I have online store checked. Again, uh, I think that Wix is a little more user friendly when it comes to like brand new, haven't really built a website because Shopify does have a lot more things you need to learn, um, but that's cool. Add files, I'm gonna use the same picture. Okay, price, we're gonna mark it at 50. So we got five, stock number, okay, Mercedes weighs 1.2 pounds, and then I'm going to add the variance. Now, I seem, the variance seemed a little harder for me on, um, on Wix, but... So those are that, those are that, <laughs> those are my sizes. We got our color, okay? And then you can always add another option if you want to, material, whatever, whatever. You can just keep on going. And then now this has our SKU number, our price, our quantity, right? So we're gonna go ahead and publish this. You can add some tags. Collections, we don't have any collections yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on our homepage. I'm gonna mark this as a hoodie. Obviously there are a lot of things that um, I'm kind of skipping over just because I want to show you just the overall of the websites. Cause it will, we will literally be in here for hours and hours and you should definitely sign up for my, um, my t-shirt webinar if you want to get a little bit more in depth with it but for now let's go ahead and let's see we can set up our store okay update home page so now they're taking us to what your customers will see. And so this is basically where you start out here. Just like Wix, Shopify has a ton of themes. A whole lot of them are free and they look great. And then there are some that um, will cost you, but they look even better. They offer a lot more features or they come with some different things. This is one of their free um, themes. So it's already kind of structured. We do have a product up here already. So we can change a lot. Like it even has like different ways you can change it. Uh, let's see, let's talk about your brand. Welcome to our store. So yeah, they have all kind of little features and you just hit save over there to save it. Uh, now on Wix, they do have an auto save. But Shopify be like, mm -mm, you hit save, you do it. I was trying to see the change of this. So you can change it and it can just say girl plus guy. You can add your own logo here and Wix. Um, you got your shopping cart right there. So we could literally change all of this. We can do it today. But again, it does look a little bit more complex than Wix. However, um, like I said, Shopify is going to provide a really great long-term solution for you if you are looking to like, oh, I'm about to be the next multi-millionaire in this thing. I would definitely say Shopify is um, the place for you. And not, not to say if you go with Wix that you're not going to be the next millionaire because trust, there are millionaires um, on Shopify for sure. However, it's just not going to provide you with the same features as Shopify, but it does still look good. It look good, right? Like it looks good. It can do the trick. And if you're somebody who you don't really need that much of a capacity for a store or a huge e-commerce solution, Wix is, is going to be cool for you, right? With Shopify and even with Wix, because I'm way more familiar with Shopify, um, there are so many different things to help you succeed. 
Um, the app store is going to be your best friend. All right. Basically, the app store is how you add every single thing to your website. So they already have it up here. Oh, Burlo, a drop shipping app, right? They have a sales um, countdown timer. They have uh, exit intent pop-ups. They have Facebook. So what does all this mean for you? They're basically providing solutions for you to make more money because obviously the more you sell, the more money they get, like I said before. So something like a sales countdown timer, that's great for your customers because they're like, oh, I got to hurry up, the sense of urgency. So they're like, oh, let me rush, let me rush. So you definitely want something like that. A drop shipping app like Oberlo, of course, you don't even have to worry about printing your own stuff. Exit intent pop-ups, that means that when somebody tries to leave your website, you can be like, wait, 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 did you know I got 10% off for you? You know what I'm saying? So these are the things that can like change the game with your website. Um, Shopify also has Shopify Capital. So when you start making enough money, just like a lot of other companies, they say, hey, we got a little bit of a bag for you if you want it. We got, you know, we got some money for you, but they are going to get their money off the top. So be careful when you grab um, all of your, your, your capital loans and all that, but that's a whole nother video. So yes, you can literally come into your app store, go to search and you can search all of the apps that they have. Um, so some of my favorite apps would be something like I have a sales countdown timer. Um, I do have a sticky cart, which means that the car is go going to go up and down the website with your customer. Let's see what else. And they have them in different categories too. So if you're like, dang, I need some marketing. Dang, I need some conversion help. Like I really want to upsell some products. Uh, Frequently Bought Together is another one of my favorite ones. Uh, upsell. So that just means like making sure your customers are buying multiple things. Uh, you got Papa, just so much. Um, and honestly, I do believe that Wix also has an app store that you can get some really cool additions to your website as well. So we're not counting them out. It's just that I think that Shopify has uh, so many resources for every entrepreneur and all of the big companies, they use Shopify and it can just handle when you have those million dollar days. And that's what I think about, like, who's going to be able to handle when I have a million dollar day? And I'm, I'm still not, I'm not saying Wix cannot. I'm just saying that's how I think about it when I make my decision. So again, two really great resources. Um, hopefully this helps you if you are just looking to start and you're like, I have no idea how, how to build a website, but I just need to figure out and get my products up and rolling. Um, Wix, Shopify, two really great solutions that can help you to do that, all right? Um, please make sure if you have any questions, you leave them down below so I know what you wanna see next. Um, I'm excited for you building your store, getting all that you gotta get. And no matter which solution you go with, I know that as long as you start, you're gonna be good, right? I already know that you are gonna kill it, you are gonna be successful, you are gonna sell your shirts or all of your products. So I'm just so excited for you. Uh, make sure that you click the link in my bio to see all that I have for you, all the resources I have for you to help you sell even more, to help you get started. Um, but just know I'm cheering you on. And um, yeah, leave me all of your questions, your comments. Give this video a thumbs up, guys. Make, the, make sure that you subscribe. And because I know that it, it was still so much more that we have to talk about, but definitely check the bio out so that you can get more insight. Love you guys. And I will see you in the next video.